This week's recipe, dried shredded chicken, is the perfect food to always have on hand to make a quick meal or snack. It's a versatile dish that's really easy to make. Here are the ingredients we will need. Chicken breast, sugar, minced onions, minced garlic, fish sauce, salt, water, and ground white pepper. We start by preparing the marinade. In a large bowl, add sugar, the minced onions and garlic, salt, and lastly, the fish sauce. Now we combine all the ingredients until the sugar is dissolved. Next, we prepare the chicken. To achieve the nice shreds of chicken, we need to cut with the grain of the meat. First, we cut off the small section that divides the chicken breast. Now cutting along the grain of the meat, we slice into smaller chunks. Cutting it this way will make it really easy to shred the chicken once it's cooked. For the smaller piece of chicken, the grain runs at a diagonal, so we also want to cut diagonally. Add the chicken pieces into the marinade. Toss everything together and make sure all of the chicken pieces are evenly coated. Allow it to marinate for 30 minutes. Add the chicken into a large skillet or pan. Place the thicker pieces in the center and the thinner ones closer to the edge. Pour in the remaining marinade and add the water. Cover the pan and cook on medium-low heat for 6 minutes. After 6 minutes, flip the chicken pieces and then cover, turn the heat to low and cook for another 6 minutes. Keep your eyes on the liquid level during this last half of the cooking process. There should be a constant amount of liquid. If too much is evaporating, add more water. The chicken is cooked now and we can transfer into a bowl. Place some chicken into a bowl and using a pestle, smash the chicken. We want to smash with the grain of the chicken to get the nice shreds. Work with a few pieces of the chicken at a time. Now separate and tear any large chunks of chicken with your fingers. Heat a large skillet or wok over medium heat, and when it's hot, add oil. Now add the shredded chicken. The reason we cook the chicken this second time is to dry it out. Use a big spoon or spatula to rub the chicken and separate the shreds further. If you have a potato masher, it does a great job with separating the chicken. Continue separating the chicken and cook for a total of five minutes. Let's season with some ground white pepper and then we're all finished. I love to eat this dried shredded chicken with soft cooked rice or oatmeal. Another great way to enjoy this is to make it into a sandwich. Hi, I hope you've enjoyed this easy how-to video. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to post below. For full recipes, check out runawayrice.com. I work on new recipes each week, so please subscribe to my channel to stay tuned. This is Trang wishing you good eating and good health. Thanks for watching.